All right, today we're about to unravel a financial tale that's as intriguing as it is baffling. Let's call this one the Forrest Gump trade, where a company's decision to go public will have you scratching your head in disbelief. Think of it as hosting a beach party during a snowstorm. That's the level of unexpected we're diving into. So here we go. It's a story, and I'm going to uncover why this decision has left many of us wondering, what on earth were they thinking? Meet Better Mortgage, a company known for mortgages and home financing. They decided to step into the stock market limelight, but here's the twist. They did it while mortgage rates were soaring to new heights, spiking. Now picture this, attempting to have a picnic in the pouring rain. That's the level of head scratching going on here. Better Mortgage's entry to the stock market was no ordinary journey. They teamed up with Aurora Acquisition Corp, a special purpose acquisition company. It's a SPAC. SPACs, they're like financial vehicles that make it easier for companies to go public in a way that's not your typical IPO. Imagine two unexpected friends joining forces for an adventure. That's kind of what happened here. Now, hold on to your seats because this is where it gets wild. Right after the merger, Better Mortgage's stock plunged dramatically by about 91%. Imagine a roller coaster dropping suddenly when you're least prepared. Because this wasn't just a dip. It was more like a nosedive that let everyone stunned. There's more twists, like a twist within a twist. Better Mortgage secured a whopping $550 million from SoftBank, a financial giant from Japan. This cash injection was like a lifeline, enabling Better Mortgage to expand its mortgage offerings even in the midst of this roller coaster ride. What does all this mean? Well, regardless of who takes these guys public, Goldman Sachs, it doesn't matter. There's big risk in these deals. Stocks can drop 91% on the first day of their IPO. Be careful, don't gamble. Come check us out. My name is Jonathan Rosa, owner, Masters in Trading.